Hi, my name is Sarah. Welcome back to the channel. And today I wanted to do a little bit of a coordination video as well as just a what's been up with my life and everything kind of video. Um, so today we are going to be courting Squirrel Party by Bonnie Line. And yeah, so we'll go through how I do my makeup, my wig, um, all of that. We will go through everything while I am talking to you. So first, let's get the dress out. Okay, so first we want to get the blouse on, which I am doing right now. Um, I also have my bloombers on, and as you can see, my usukumia is dead in the corner. Hello! So, let's get that dress on. Take it off the mannequin. There we go, getting it on, getting my bunny ear out of the way. <laughs> this dress always has problems zipping up for me. So I wanted to do a little bit of a what's been going on in my life. Recently, I have been moving. Uh, I moved out of a one-bedroom apartment that I lived in with my family, um, my mom and my two siblings. So I recently moved out of there and into a new house. Um, I have taken over the garage, as you can see, and I look forward to making more content in said garage. Um, I have a couple of videos lined up that I haven't recorded. Um, as you can see, I'm just adjusting my blouse and my rosette. But I have a couple videos lined up, um, a couple of things that I would really like to do. And yeah. And as you can see, I am now stepping into my petticoat, tying that bitch up. Um, just getting comfortable in the cord. But yeah, I've been moving. Um, things have been going well between me and my current partner. Um, I actually recently got a pet tarantula whose name is Asbestos. I will post pictures now after a trigger warning. Um, so skip to this timestamp if you do not want to see pictures of a tarantula. But he is a Brazilian redhead and he is just so, so precious. Um, right now I'm just brushing out my hair, trying to get it to look good for the cord. It's a little bit messy. Here we go. So, recently I've been uh, hosting a lot of calm meets and I have been really busy doing that. I haven't had much time for myself. Um, I've mostly been spending it on getting those meets happening and there was some drama in my discord server where um, some of the mods weren't doing some stuff that we were not happy about and let me rephrase that some of the mods were doing some stuff we weren't happy about so we created a new discord server for our um, area so we've split into two different columns for the same area so it's been a little bit of a rough patch um, when it comes to the calm and uh, you know all that so yeah um, I currently run the second discord um, so I've been putting a lot of time and effort into there and I've been doing my best to keep it a nice safe community um, something that I want to advocate for is community. I think that community should make the decisions in Discord servers and such. Um, 
I think that especially when it comes to Lolita, the community should be involved in decision making. But that's all I'm going to say on that. So first, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be prepping my face with some foundation as soon as I get all my stuff out of the bag. So let's get this foundation on. Just making sure, doing one final pat around to make sure that it's all nice and even. After that, we are going to be prepping our eyelashes, so we're going to be getting them, uh, we're going to put the glue on them, excuse me. We are going to put the glue on the eyelashes just so that they are drying while we are doing our makeup. Um, I found this to be a lot easier than just having them dry on their own. Next up, we're going to be using some all-over glitter that I got from Walmart to line the underneath of my eyes with it. Um, I find that this gives me... it just makes my eyes pop a little bit. Um, I really love the way that it makes my eyes look. Next up is eyebrows, so we want to make sure that my eyebrows are nice and defined. Um, I found that having defined eyebrows helps a lot with Lolita, so we want to make sure that they look nice, defined, and um, pretty filled in. Alrighty, the next step we are doing our mascara, just again prepping for the fake eyelashes. Uh, I do mascara just because my eyelashes are kind of a lighter color. Um, so, oh yes, I also open my mouth when I'm doing uh, mascara. But um, prepping for the eyelashes because my eyes are a little bit lighter. Alright, now I'm just doing a little bit of an outline with eyeliner. Um, I don't like to do my whole eye with eyeliner because it's pretty difficult to get off. I just line where the 
eyelashes the fake eyelashes are going to end and start that way it gives it co a complete look um i find that the band of the eyelash makes it look like i'm wearing eyeliner so there there you have it <laughs> um next up is blush blush is really important when it comes to lolita um it gives you a more youthful look um, I say as I'm 19, but it gives you a more youthful look and it, um, it really ties it all together. Alright, lastly, we are doing our eyelashes. one on and got the other on just doing a little bit of readjusting <laughs> Finalizing the eyeliner, just making it look like a full eye of eyeliner. A little bit more readjusting. And that is all. That is all for the makeup portion. and we are good to go thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed today's video as i did um so again today's print is squirrel party by bodyline and all of my accessories will be linked down in the description below as well as my social medias where you can find me and my daily activities and yeah thank you guys so much i can't wait for more content this year to come out um i'm very excited to get these things on track especially now that i'm in my new house so yeah um this is frilled criminal and i will see you in the next video